Hello everyone, it's me, the Chuck Smash, bringing you another Chuck Simulator commentary, and as you can see here, we are doing... I am in the bonus episode. Um, you have caught me on a lovely journey, going from... Um, some place, I, I don't know, I think from, from Swansea to Zurich. Um, so we are currently travelling like down this road here. Um, and like I said in the previous video, we this this is the bonus episode. Actually, I didn't say that in the previous video, but um, no, I think I may have done it. I don't remember. But in in this video, this is the bonus episode because uh, well, because I didn't get one uploaded on Sunday night, and you guys were awesome enough to get 35 likes on that video before 9 p.m. So you know, you guys were awesome enough and cool, and it was like yeah, okay. I can upload it then, so I've got it uploaded now. Um, this is it, and I hope you enjoy it. As you could, as you just saw there, I do have the old. I say old; it is still fairly new. The uh, Daniel's ETS2 companies, real companies mod, um, which I have now put back in. I still have this new mod in use, as you can see here. Um, I'm also using a different truck mod now. Um, I would love. I, I'm tempted to make you guess what truck I'm using. And then I tell you in like in, in like the next video what truck it was, but I want to show you the, the outside as well, and I want to be able to go for everything with it. So the truck I'm driving is a oh we can't really see it no, like that. Okay, so the truck I'm driving is getting away in the road in the middle is a Malcolm truck. Um, the credits go to uh, DHSDK for completing it. The download link or well, for creating it, the download link is in the description of the video. Credits will also go out to Thumper Legs who. Um, who helped DJZK and other modders uh, actually get it so that you could have different paint jobs as skins rather than I don't know I don't know but I know that he helped do the paint jobs and stuff but DJZK is the one that created the work of art um, which is really awesome um, if I get to if I get a chance to stop um, I don't think the journey is I'm not going to finish this delivery um, in whilst you guys want whilst whilst you whilst I'm videoing, unfortunately. Um, but the the trailer I've got is a fuel tanker, and it is incredibly difficult to drive. Seriously, it's just absolutely insane. It's like ah no, just stay going the right way. But yeah, so this is this is the bonus episode that I was sort of promising you guys on Sunday. There we go, straight straight road. Let's do it. This is the Malcolm truck. Lots of light ish. Yeah not the most light that you can get on it. But as we get more light, but you know, it's not too bad I guess. I kind of think the light on this is just kind of is kind of bad in a way because like it goes pitch black even when there's light in front of you and it's like seriously. <sighs> I'm really tired. Like so you see that wouldn't happen. I don't know why I'm tired. I went to bed early last night. I think. Yeah no I did go to bed quite early last night. Um I don't know, it's been a very long day at work, man. I hate Christmas. Why is it that shops always employ people before Christmas? It's like, yes. Let's get new people in and give them hell for the next couple of days because for the next month or so because obviously it's like it's gonna be busy. Everyone knows that. Everyone knows that working is busy on Christmas time of year. And it's just like I know, I'm trying to trying to think of what I was thinking of. <laughs> that makes sense. No no no. But it's like I don't know. I don't know. I, I, my mind's just gone blank. Uh, yeah. Bonus episode? No. But no. Nah. There. Let's play. It's tomorrow night. There's not really much to talk about, really. There's no SCS software updates, which is really unfortunate. I was like, it said on the latest blog that was like posted the other day on the latest blog post. Even we only have one blog, guys. Oh god. Oh god. Too fast. No. We're only going 54. Speed limit's 56. <laughs> Let's go to speed limit, everyone. I don't really care about the conditions. They should say what speed to go in the ice and the snow and stuff. They don't, so therefore the speed limit is 56. So I will go 56. But yeah, it's kind of SCS software in the latest blog post did say that they would be uploading, posting more. <sighs> oh, I am really tired. <laughs> more, uh, more blog posts in the coming weeks and days and stuff. But we haven't seen one yet. It's been a couple of days. It's like, come on, SCS. It's almost Christmas. Give us something. Um, I really hope they don't release DLC before Christmas or any updates. I mean, I mean, I have a feeling they're going to release DLC anytime soon, and it's going to be like, no, but wait, I don't have the money. Because <laughs> after Christmas, I get paid, so I can then buy DLC and stuff straight away without having to ask my parents and be like, 
I know it's nearly Christmas and you've spent all of your money on me already, but come on. Just a bit more. <laughs> nah, but it's kind of like, not, not literally like that, of course, but it's kind of like, I'd like to be able to buy it when I get paid rather than them release it before. If they do release DLC, they still haven't confirmed about DLC or anything yet. Um, but it, I, in my opinion, I have not yawned so much in the single video. But in my opinion, it's kind of like... Uh, oh, hello, income. 964 quid from Utrecht. He must be a foreign driver. Cool. But yeah, um, what was I thinking? So about the blog and and oh yeah, it would be a good idea in my opinion that for SCS Optus to actually to actually do DLC because obviously they can still earn money from ETS2 without relying on just solid game sales. They can still release stuff because obviously people that have already bought the game won't need to buy, spend any more money on it if they don't release DLC. Whereas if they don't release DLC, people who have already bought the game need to spend more money on it, which in my opinion isn't that bad. I mean, it keeps SCS going on different. I'm going to yawn again. <sighs> I didn't yawn at all before I started recording this video. And now I've started the video, it's like, I'm going to yawn now just because I feel like it. And it's like, come on, let me wake up so that I can do the video. And it's like, nope, you're falling asleep. That's the way it works. You're going to fall as well. Okay. Thing is, I can't fall asleep because A, I've got to try and talk for 15, for 15 minutes, which is not as easy as it sounds. I don't know how I do it normally. <laughs> ah, turn out. But I've also got to try and drive um, and be alert. Especially since it's night time. Yeah, oh, excellent, excellent, excellent. I can do this. Right, look, 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 look. It, Please say it'll work. Yes! Look at that. Now, this is what I was trying to show you guys in the previous video. Now, you'll, you'll, you'll see that this does change. If I just do that, it makes it. Or, I don't know. Um, if I turn them all off. I'll just do that. Let's see. It's more obvious. But look, if you want to take photos and you want your beacons to be proper, then you just do that. You press F. Is it F4? Yeah. F4 allows you to do that, and then you just click any of these, I think even beacons, but then that makes it a big jumper, a, a bigger jump. Whereas if you've done that, low beam or high beam, ah, okay, high beam is better. And it turns it around, although high beam is slower, so you get a more accurate thingy, I think, yeah. Or you can do that, and then you can have like a nice solid sort of thingy, yeah. There we go, that's what I was trying to show you guys um, before I was trying to do it really badly. But yeah, so that's cool. I'm glad I managed to do that. Um, yeah. No, I wasn't, don't know why I didn't really think of it doing it like that, because like that was easy. Just the TV camera, then F, F, F4, was it? Yeah, and then F4, and then it's like, easy. But I didn't really think of that. I just thought, thing with camera, it has to be. It's like, no, it doesn't. Oh, is that a train or a truck? A truck and a car. The lights go under the bridge, apparently. Apparently the bridge is glass and see-through and stuff. There's still a lot of work SCS needs to do on this game, there really is, but it's a brilliant game. Don't get me wrong, if you're new to watching my videos and you've only just seen the game, I'm going to yawn again. <sighs> oh, stop yawning! <laughs> um, but th this game is absolutely brilliant, and if you, this is your first time seeing it, there is, there's no, it doesn't come by default. You do have to download mods and, oh, do we have a toll, great. Oh, great, we have a toll. Okay, this should be interesting. Let's hope I don't crash into it. I usually crash into these things. Going too fast, don't stop in time, and then just boom. I just crash. But, I might not this time. Will I? We're going slow. And if I just get as close as I can, because we are... There we go, right, so this is the start of the toll road. Yeah, how far? Not too far. Cool. Um, but, yeah, the, uh, the mod is created by Stefag40 and 116808. LPD, um, for those of you that don't know, link is in the description of the video. As well as other stuff, I've chucked quite a lot of links in the description of the video, for example, any download links for mods that you see, like Daniel's ETS2 company mods, um, and um, my Facebook page. <sighs> I am really not that tired. I need to stop. Whenever I yawn, I always make a um, sort of a statement about my yawn. I am not that tired. Shut up, yawn. Stop yawning. It's like, seriously? Stop it now, it's getting like, looks like, yes. But, kind of like, I don't know, it's hard to, I've forgotten what I was talking about really, apart from, oh yeah, links, links, links. I have like links to forums and stuff, and a few websites, I think, no, I don't know, actually. 
I have any links for any forms actually. I need to put. I thought I had Cocky Size Form because that's a form that I'm partnered with um, in the description of the video, but I don't. I've got to put that in there at some point because, in fact, I'll put it in at the end of the video. Are you guys going to wait for me or are you going to try pulling out? You're going to try pulling out because you are a very stupid bus driver, aren't you? Or I managed to stop in time because I saw you pulling out and I was like, yep, yeah, he's going to pull out. Put my brakes on. They don't, you don't, you guys don't sit there for that long, do you? Come on, drive! You're killing my engine now, bus driver. What a bus driver, it's just seeing my engine sort of trying to pick up speed back up the hill, and it's like, oh, I don't like my truck dying. It is fully upgraded, so you know, it's kind of like, seriously, just, just, yeah, no. Let's go into TV camera. Oh god. Yeah. Oh, cool, we got this area. Uh, there we go, like that, there we go. High beam, so you get to see it more. This is cool. <sighs> I am. I don't plan to do another video while I'm tired because I think this video kind of sucks. Not really. I'm joking. Wow. Well, I wish sometimes when I'm not tired, I can pull out a better video than when I am tired. Like now, I'm struggling to talk about stuff because I just want to sleep and be like, yeah, I need sleep. So it's been so knackering. Seriously, it's just. In one of those days where it's just, oh my god, there's been no stopping. It's been continuous work, but it's all good because hopefully tomorrow's not going to be as hard, but it will be because I know it will. But it's fine, it's work for you. Any of you younger kids that are, that are hoping to start work soon, it is busy, and unless it's a different kind of job, in which case it may not be busy, but it probably will be. Um. <laughs> And they'll just say like, yeah, okay, let's let's be inspirational to the younger kids. Let's not. Oh, okay. If you say so. Right, anyways, so we are nearly at the uh oh 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 at the toll gate. Let's see how much this has charged me. I don't need to do another I don't need to sleep again. I have got time to sleep again. ETA three forty two, so not too long. It better not charge me too much. Who else? There's a here's a little question for everyone. Who else um sort of goes into the correct lane of the toll booth, the one on the far end, or like wherever the sign at the top says to, for trucks to go? And who tries to play it realistically by going to as close as you can to the window thingy stuff? Thirty quid, not too bad. I've got. 5.7 million euros, so 30 quid ain't nothing really. I do need to buy new garages still. I want to just, yeah, I'd be absolutely, I'd be a billionaire if I upgraded every garage I saw probably. I'd be like, yeah, just drivers earning money here, there, and everywhere. Have money pouring out my ears. Man, nah, that's the dream. That's the dream. Money pouring out your ears. Be like, yeah. When you go to a hotel and you find out you can't do something, it's like, I own the hotel now. I'm just give them the money. Yeah. <laughs> uh man, I just got that from Batman. Don't know what film. Dark Knight. No, Begins. Yeah, Begins. It's a quality film, quality film. Man, I'm gonna end the video here, I think, because uh I don't know, I just think it should be ended here. This is a cool bonus episode and this is the cool track down the link in the description. Um I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did please give it a rating. If you didn't let me know why, although I don't know. Yeah. Anyways, so thanks for watching and goodbye.